Hello everyone and welcome back to this let's play of Rome Total War Remastered, played on very hard difficulty. So at the minute uh, we have 39 regions and we need 50. We've just gone to war with these guys in the northeast and uh, yeah we took two regions from them right from the start, that's pretty good. But I think because of their geography it's going to be quite hard to fight the rest of them. Brutii yeah, are actually attacking over there as well. I actually want this army out of the settlement if possible, although it looks like I can just retrain them here. That's yes. not too bad. So, Kill let's them. fight off these guys first Kill of all. Um, we shall rule. Nice. Okay, yeah. I want to stop them from sieging so I can General. retrain that army. Uh, if we can as well, actually, I wouldn't mind maybe building some more units here. That could work out pretty well. And we're going to start pushing maybe towards this settlement yeah i think that that's probably the best thing to do so we'll, uh, we'll finish off these guys and we can always get some mercenaries along the way if we need them um there's plenty of stuff i can get here uh, we'll probably just have a mercenary army there but i'm gonna use this army to fight them and that should put my territorial expansion up to 41, I think, if I manage to take all of them. And then it's basically just Italy and I've won uh, the campaign. But that won't be for quite a while. Uh, we have two big armies here in Italy now. And I'm hoping to make it three because I'm still... Well, I guess all my construction is finished, so... We'll put these units together. No, I don't want to do that. I don't want to put them in there. I want to put them about there. And we will take all of these guys, put them in there with a general. Uh, yeah, we have quite a lot of stuff here, actually. Could I retrain some of this, maybe? Yes, I can. Uh, in fact, I'll leave them there until they can get retrained. We have some onages now and some archers, so I'll put them in there. And onages for that army. I'll we'll have some oranges for this army. Uh, probably just get rid of them. Swap them with the oranges. Good stuff. Because every army is going to need at least one siege weapon so that I can take things quickly. Uh, here we will get rid of some Batarians. I put oranges in. Good stuff. Nice. We've got three strong armies in Italy. Um. Although I am worried about the Brutii, I want to hold them off as long as I can. We have no money left either. Don't really have enough to fund more sail. units. So I think I'm going to have to just kind of deal with what I've got. So we'll start to move my Spanish army down into position. And we have a general as well. That's really good. What do we have here? We have two Praetorians. Um, I'll leave them there. And this army is going to hopefully take uh, some of Africa. We have some units here as well. And yeah, the civil war is definitely drawing closer. But there's not really much else I can do this turn. So we'll probably end the turn there. Uh, hopefully the tax rate will drop that down a bit. And are they building stuff? They need to be building things. They're actually not. Uh, I actually didn't realise I forgot to destroy their, um, their temple, yes. or build a temple of Jupiter, hopefully I can keep control, what? Oh, I didn't realise you could rename settlements, that's interesting. I think that must be something new to the game, I've never seen that before, until just now. Don't know how many turns I'm in, but that, yeah, it's, I didn't know I could do that, that's pretty cool. I was kind of hoping Pontus would do well, uh, but they're kind of getting pincer attacked here. I could try and help them by starting the Civil War. Um, or they get too weak to fight back, but Numidia have just been destroyed, which is really good. Uh, although, to be honest, Numidia I wasn't really fighting. Uh, they kind of just weren't really relevant for most of this game. Um, they looked a little bit threatening early on, but they didn't do anything, so yeah, I just kind of left them to it. So these guys have quite a few small armies dotted around. Uh, I think we'll push up for this one next. 
not really much I can take out of these settlements, so I think we'll move up here. Probably build a watchtower just so I can see everything that's going on. And hopefully we'll take this one in the next two turns. Like I say though, they do have a lot of small armies dotted around, but we're training there. We should probably be building some more units here as well. And let's consolidate more of our forces together. And what else can we do here? Do they have onagers? They do. Ah, we have quite a few good stuff here as well. Retrain some of them. In fact, I really should be putting everything into the settlement to get retrained. So let's see if I can do that. Um, and there. Yeah, that should do. Uh, we really want to make sure that everything is as strong as possible for when the time of the Civil War comes. And that's pretty much all I can do. A lot of these next few turns are going to be really fast. I'm not going to be able to build much, unfortunately, um, as I just start to put my armies together. But I'm feeling confident. As long as we can hold off the Brutti Eye, we should be within a good chance of winning. Um, Skippy Eye have left a lot of their regions undefended. So hopefully we'll be able to take them. Um, I think this army's nearly ready to go. I'll build another Praetorian just to be on the safe side. And that's pretty much all I can do. Uh, these armies obviously they're just um, waiting. We have a lot of stuff here. A lot of stuff to upgrade and repair. And we're just going to keep pushing uh, with this war up here for the time being as well. That'll just give us something to do while we're preparing our armies. I either, I either have 39 or 40, I can't remember. Provinces, but... To be honest, Greece would be the best bet. Um, unfortunately, the Brutti Eye are far too powerful. Not that I've tried to attack them yet, but... Ah, okay, so when I ended the turn, I had my mouse cursor going down, so for the rest of this turn, it's going to keep travelling downwards, and here come Pontus again. That's going to put a spanner in the works. That's actually not good. Wow. Okay, that's fair enough. Not really sure what interest Pontus have with attacking me though. Wow, okay, so we learned the last time Pontus were extremely difficult to deal with. So I'm expecting the same again. Yes. I was really hoping to push this war forward. Um, this is not really ideal. I could fight them, but it's going to have to... I'll probably have to command the battle myself. Um, which is fine. See if we can get some more of these units retrained. Good stuff. Um, and yeah, we'll pretty much just be retraining. Everything that has already been retrained, I'll take out of the city. And I'll leave the barbarians for the time being. Uh, we'll just keep retraining everything that we can. Yeah, there's not really much else I can do. Pontus has attacked me, so I'm probably going to have to deal with that now. Uh, and I'm just going to have to leave my construction for the time being, because we're going to need to keep a little bit of money back. These guys have attacked me, I'm not really sure why. So let's see if we can take care of these guys. Yeah, okay, good. Good, siege is broken. Pontus is going to be difficult to deal with, absolutely. Uh, we don't really have much as well, so I'm going to have to pull this army back to deal with Pontus. Um, that's unfortunate. And again, Brutii, yeah, they're just so powerful uh, with what they have that I just really need to be careful. Um, I think there's going to come a point where civil war is going to be inevitable. But we'll just have to wait and see what happens. 
and I might actually have enough money next turn to start constructing again. On to SWAT, what do they want? Let us know. Ceasefire, it yes, I want a ceasefire. Our Thank tank. you. I just wasted a turn there, pulling my army back. We now have a ceasefire. I'm not really sure what Pontus is up to. Uh, it seems really random that they just attacked me and then wanted a ceasefire. But that's okay. I'm happy with that because it means I can keep uh, keep my settlement. So, yes. I'm going to push back this way again. And now I think we can deal with construction. So let's just see, because we have a fair amount of money now, uh, let's just start constructing things. Anything that's going to get me some money would be good. Yeah, yep. And then we can go into the previous turn and see what we needed to build there. There's going to be quite a lot that needs building, no doubt. Oh, in fact, I build roads there okay. yeah that and build that yeah that's pretty much uh pretty much okay got a little bit more money left and i've kind of lost track of what needs doing uh there was a lot of barbarian stuff here i wanted to sort out but i don't think i'm going to be able to right now uh, hopefully me just Keeping those territories will keep them under control. Uh, over time, they'll start to become more loyal. That's my hope, anyway. Um, build more units here. And let's go over to Italy now. See if anything needs retraining. Uh, yeah, it's pretty much okay. Again, we'll pull all of the upgraded units out. And yeah, they're upgraded. These guys are getting upgraded now, and I'm gonna put this to this in here. And yeah, what about take that out? Take that out. There we are. And we'll use the rest of the money from this turn. Retrain these. There we are. I'll probably take a few more turns. Um, things are looking okay. Yeah, things are looking pretty okay, to be honest. Really want to start attacking the Romans. Really would like to, but things over here are keeping me too occupied at the minute. I actually forgot that I was building an army over here. We've got some legionaries. I'll put them there, maybe. What can we do here? Maybe there? What happened there? Okay, good stuff. And we have some of these guys. I'll put them in. Nice. And some of these guys. And a general as well. I didn't know I had a general. Oh, we'll put all of these in. General! Imperator! And we'll take out early legionaries. And there we have another full army. Nice. I'll probably use that army to attack Greece, maybe. Probably the best thing to do. But uh, yeah, I think we'll end the turn there. Let the other factions take their turn and see what happens. Well, there's actually only... Um, like four factions left apart from the Romans now. And I feel like if I expand anymore, we're going to push a civil war. Now, the AI in this game is not great. So I think I might be able to actually win uh, without the brute AI doing too much. And yeah, there's lots of little armies spread out across the territories. I'm really not happy about. Uh, oh, my faction leader died. Oh, that's a shame. Oh, yeah, new turn. Probably two turns before I can get there. And uh, 
Yeah, let's see. We are still retraining these guys, so that'll take a few more turns. We have plenty of oranges now, I believe, anyway. And we could even be building more armies, even like smaller ones, although we don't really have the money. Would like to focus on construction. Um, foundry, very useful. Army barracks, again, very useful. Blacksmith. That won't be built until I break the siege, but not to worry. That's fine. And that's fine. And all the money's gone. Fantastic. So again, we'll have to try and break the siege. And I might even build some um, and watch there. Might stop them trying to attack me all the time. I think we're building units here as well. Yeah, we are good. Good, good, good. And these guys are pretty much retrained now. So they're back to full fighting strength. Nothing else being built there just yet, but I'm not worried about that. Uh, so, yeah, again, a few more turns before the Civil War. Not really much else to do at the minute. I would just fail the Senate mission, but I'm not really worried about that either. I really hope Pontus are able to fight off Brutii. I think the best thing I could probably do now is just attack them. Um, it would definitely spread uh, Brutii thin a bit. But then they might just end up taking all my ground, so... That wouldn't be good either. Having to weigh up my option, you know? And there's a plague there. Fantastic. So, yeah, everything's pretty much been built, ready to go. Big army here, I'm worried about. A lot of undefended territory. They have a few armies dotted around the area. Um, let's see, can I attack the settlement? I can, great. So, that'll probably be taken in the next turn. Yeah, again, they just have a little army dotted about. Really annoying, actually. Really annoying. Hmm. I think what I could probably do, I could probably take these two in one or two turns. I could take these two. Yeah, I could take all them. Rome might be difficult to deal with. They have some huge armies there. Um, and I might be in for a long protracted war against the House of Brudii. Saying that, they have a lot of armies, so if I start taking the settlements, they might start running out of money. Uh, the Skippy I am not really concerned about or worried. I'm really, I'm really looking forward to getting the Civil War started. City expands. Let's see what we can build here. Another, yeah, uh, it expanded. Doesn't look like it has. Uh, they don't look happy though. Uh, they've rioted. Ah, okay, so I think what's happened is a few, few of the uh, people have been killed. This must be what's happened there. Uh, but we can now consolidate our armies. I don't think I'll bother upgrading the barbarians. I might, but it's not a priority. So, this can be pretty much one army. I uh, wouldn't mind some cavalry in there, actually, if I can, I can get some cavalry in there take out these units. Cavalry in. Nice, there's one army done. This all looks a bit messy at the moment, but it won't soon enough. Put these two together. Uh, take out him, 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 and him. And yep, that's two armies. Nice. So should my first target be Rome? Probably should actually. Um, that would, yeah, that, that makes more sense. My first target's probably going to be Rome. What do we have here? I, I could hit Rome with everything I've got. Might be the thing to do here. 
because I think once the civil war starts, your allies will never stop attacking you. These three armies here are obviously concerning. They have so much, the House of Brutii. This is going to be crazy difficult. It's going to be so hard. Um, yeah, we already. Yeah, so that's going to be ready in one turn. And I think I'm just going to go for it. Um, there we are. I think we can do this. I really do. Uh, once I destroy Rome altogether, at least. So, Rome as a faction, they still have their big armies in the city. If I can somehow get them out of the city, I'll have a better chance of destroying the faction altogether. So I think I might be ready to start the Civil War. It might go horribly, horribly wrong, but I would like to try it. Ah, okay, that right there is not something I needed to happen. So that has definitely slowed things down. I'm now going to have to use that army that um, I was building to invade Scipii to go up and recapture that settlement. So that is not ideal. Which is a shame. I was really looking forward to getting things started. We're under siege. Hmm. Well, I may have to put things on hold for the time being. And they want me to recapture that rebel settlement. I completely agree. Uh, that's a, that's what's really annoying about that is I've just moved my units out of out of Spain. Um, that's actually really annoying. But never mind. These things happen. Could I? I captain. Hmm. Actually, what I'll do, I'll leave that army where it is, and I'll basically just build some units in these settlements to retake it, and if there's anything here that can be spared, I'll use them as well. Although I was building an army here, wasn't I? I totally forgot about that. So I can use that army, actually, yeah. I totally forgot I was building an army here. And my plan will be use this army to retake the rebel settlement and keep this army here ready to attack um, the Romans. We'll finish off this one first. Nice. Another settlement under my control. Yeah, get rid of that. Drop the tax rate. There we are. Good stuff. Is that Jupiter? No, that's Ceres. I want a temple of Jupiter. There we are. Okay, nice. Wow. So I think uh, that. I mean, I was I was thinking about getting ready to just attack them now. They don't have onages in that army. We need to put onages in there. There we are. We have onages here as well. So, uh, do I can do. I have a lot of armies here as well I'm going to have to deal with. I was really looking forward to starting the Civil War though. Oh, I have this army I totally forgot about. Um... What are we doing with this again? I think we were going to use it to take Greece. Seems like the logical thing to do. March. I'll move them towards Greece. I'm not going to be able to start the Civil War until next time, I don't think. 
that's a bit of a shame but we've made a little bit of ground today and might not even be next time because yeah that me losing that settlement wasn't a good sign but anyway I just want to thank you all very much for watching today please like subscribe and all that good stuff leave any comments if you do have any and I hope to see you guys next time. Nice. Take care.